Today's king tides are real-world time machines. Occurring on just a few days each year, they show us the kinds of tidal flooding that could occur every day within a few decades if climate change causes sea levels to rise even a few feet, as scientists predict. The most visible king tide flooding occurs at the surface, when normally dry streets and yards are temporarily inundated by tides just a foot or two above today's normal levels. But in this video, we will show a more hidden type of king tide flooding that can also cause considerable damage even in areas that don't flood at the surface. This thriving area along the banks of the tidal Piscataqua River in Portsmouth, New Hampshire, appears to stay high and dry during today's king tides. But underground, in places like the basement of the Shapley Driscoll House at Strawberry Bank Museum, it's another story. Built in 1795, this historic home's basement stays relatively dry most of the time. But during king tides, whenever the water rises a foot or more above mean high tide in the river, it seeps through the ground and floods into the basement. Unfortunately, king tides will only cause this basement to flood a few times this year. But as sea levels rise over the next decade or two, this type of flooding will become more and more common, posing a significant risk to the integrity of the building. At Strawberry Bank Museum, we are taking this king tide wake-up call seriously. We are forming mitigation plans for our buildings and doing whatever we can to reduce our contribution to climate change. We hope you will do the same. Thank you.